So today we're going to talk about going to seminars and different conferences. So when I was a really crappy coach, I never attended Super Saturdays. I never went to any of the Beachbody corporate events. I never went to like a Danny Johnson event or anything. And I remember my upline, Radana, messaging me like, hey, you going to a Super Saturday? Or, hey, here's information for a Super Saturday. And I was too worried about getting wasted. Um, my priorities weren't in where they should have been. Uh, at the age of 23, 24, I was far more concerned with getting hammered on the weekends than going to a Super Saturday event. And by God, I would never dream of going to something like a Danny Johnson event. And I really didn't even know what Danny Johnson was until about a year and a half into growing my business. Um, so what I want to talk with you guys is the power of going to these events. Uh, I attended my first Danny Johnson event, I think September of 2012, and I was still having a hard time not being one of those salespeople you see on um, Instagram or Facebook who just come off as a really bad beach body coach. And I had a really hard time getting people involved. I didn't know anything about what scripts were. And so I went to a Danny Johnson event and it rocked my world. I learned scripts. I learned forming. I learned how to not vomit on people and overwhelm them with everything. And I learned how to not own the conversation, but instead to <laughs> instead to ask questions to find out what people's true needs were and what the business could really do for them if I only listened instead of just being so enamored with talking. So I got I went to this Danny Johnson event, and let me give you a little background about this Danny Johnson event. The Danny Johnson event was in South St. Louis. I ended up driving to St. Louis by myself, eight-hour drive. That was the first time I've ever driven anywhere that long of a distance by myself. I roomed up with three women who I met through a Danny Johnson Facebook group who I had no idea who they were. Really awesome women. One of them used to be a former pimp. <laughs> but she was cool as hell. Um, and so I met awesome people. I, I grew. I stepped outside of my comfort zone. I, I learned skill sets that I've passed on to you guys. And when I drove home from the Danny Johnson event, I bought her script book and the script book audio. And I listened to her script book audio disc. There's two discs. And I listened to those suckers on repeat the entire eight hours home. And you know what? That's where my success really started to bloom. Because I got home and I signed on seven coaches within my first two weeks of being back from that Danny Johnson event. Whereas had I have never gone to that event, it probably would have taken me seven years to sign on seven coaches. That is how bad I was. So getting to events is powerful because you get in this environment with awesome energy. You get to pick up on new skill sets that you could pass on to other coaches. And sure, you know, like I, I like to say like, dude, guys, like you don't really have to go to events because I pass along to you what it is that I've learned and I pass along the systems and the scripts and all that kind of stuff. But the real truth of the matter is, is I picked up on the stuff that was important for me in growing my business. I picked up on my own nuggets. What you would pick up if we attended the same event could be totally different. So, and I've attended a few Danny Johnson events and you know, she says, go to a few of them because you're either going to re in state and, and you know further develop a concept that you've already connected with from further events or you're going to pick up on new tidbits of information that you didn't really pay attention to the first couple of times and so Danny Johnson events aren't all the same she doesn't work from a script or anything during her events she feeds off from the energy and she explains a lot of new different stuff while still covering a lot of the same basic stuff as well but 
what I'm trying to get here to you guys is it's a really important to attend events as many as possible aside from just the Beachbody corporate events so there are a lot of events you could go to an Eric Worre go pro event you could go to John C Maxwell events Tony Robbins Danny Johnson Shalene Johnson you could go to um, Brendan Burchard a lot of people and what I want you to do is I want you to sit here and think of any guru that I may have mentioned or you may have sitting in the back of your head who that you really admire and what I want you to do is to make a vow and write down in the comments below who it is that you want to see within this next year and then what I also want you to do is do your own research to figure out how much tickets cost or what it's going to take in order for you to get there and if you see a price that just blows you out of the water, know that there are Facebook groups for finding lower ticket prices. Uh, there is a will and there is a way as well. You could be selling things to get yourself there. And instead of asking yourself, dude, I can't afford this. How will I ever be able to afford this? Ask yourself, what can I do to afford this?